what I try to do is, is to find a wig that looks like Gracie's hair, the same color, pretty much the same texture, yes. and pretty much the same style when she had, when her hair was thicker. Yes. So we're going to put this wig on, mm -hmm. and usually when you um, you cut your hair off, or when your hair all fall off, yes. it's going to be, the wig fits better. So it's better to, to buy a wig when your hair is when it's all gone, or we could cut your hair off for you if that's if that's what you wanted. So is there a plan it? for that right now, or she's good to go um, with her hair? No, her hair is going to all fall out. I understand that, but you, um, but there's no reason to cut it off ahead of time, no, right? No, she she has a four year old, and she don't want a daughter to see. Sure, I can imagine. Oh, okay. and, and most, a lot of people do that. A lot of people don't want their kids. So in see. preparation, so she'll just look the same. She'll, she'll look, look the same. We try to such let a beautiful her look the thing same to do. It's, yes, and yes. if you notice, we were lucky enough to have pretty much the same color, yes. pretty much the same style, yes. pretty much the same length. And so a daughter, a four-year-old daughter, will not realize that mommy is not wearing her natural hair. Okay. So here you go. Hold it in front. Okay, so. And we are both we are both very shocked at how how much it looks like her hair. Mm -hmm. Isn't that great? Mommy got her hair done. Mommy got her hair done. Yeah, there you go. And you know, if all of her hair she loses all of her hair, mm -hmm. she don't have a problem with with the hair with, with this wig uh, because she could make some adjustments at the back. Sure. Each wig has a, a part of it that she can adjust. Yes. So if, her, if she, if she loses her hair, all she does is pull the adjustment, pull it in. I see. Just, just pull it in and um, get the right, the right uh, size. Measurement, I see. The right measurement. Mm -hmm. So here we go again. Put it on. And this, uh, she got a name from the hospital. Yes. Which I am so pleased. With. Yes. And while we were on, we discussed where she could go on to your Style Seat site and find out more about the wig selection. Okay. Well, Gracie, how does it feel? It feels great. Pull it again, Gracie. Now I want you to put this wig on because I'm not going to be at home with, with you and I want you to make sure that you can put it on yourself <laughs> so that when I see you in the street it's not lopsided. Because <laughs> 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 you remember our first client said that today. Her sister buys a wig all the time and she sees her in pictures and why is your hair lopsided? The size of the wig is not correct. That's what happens. But also knowing where the clips go on your yes, wig is very important. Yes, and knowing that each wig so, has a little tab at the side. Right. And both of them has to fit exactly in front of the ear. Correct. Once it's there, the, the wig is fitted properly. It's okay. not lopsided. So look at Gracie. She does not even look like she's look wearing a that. wig. Isn't which that lovely? I am very, 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 very pleased about. She is pleased. She came in crying, and I know now she's happy. So that's uh, wonderful. Gosh, I'm glad. Thank you I'm so happy much. too. Thank you. Thank you very much. We are a wrap? Yes. Okay, thank you go. so much for your time.